Well, the Gold Coast has long been celebrated as Australia's favourite leisure and lifestyle destination, but it hasn't quite yet been recognised for the world-class sports fishing that exists here. And if you're into your kayak fishing and wanting to take your luring experience to a whole new place, then the Gold Coast has got absolutely everything you could wish for. It's got a huge variety of locations with great access all up and down the Gold Coast and the variety of target species that you can go after and chase with success with lures is just immense. You can chase whiting, brim, bass, flathead, saratoga, you can go after big trevally and tarpon, you can chase monster mangrove jack, big dew and even the big barramundi are starting to make their way down here and call the Gold Coast home. So if you're an adult that's wanting to take your lure fishing to another level, or even a kid just getting started and looking to find that fishing dream, then the next hour or so I've included a whole lot of action to get your appetite going for what's, a, what's available out here. I've included a bucket load of tips and technical advice to help you on your way to hopefully make your season a whole lot more successful and enjoy your time on the water a bit more. So welcome to the Kayaker's Guide. Come with me now and escape into the Gold Coast fishing wonderlands. Yep! Oh, got him! Oh, it's a beautiful big, like a grunter. Yes! Oh, that's, I think that's a jack. See that. That'll do it. There it is, I'm on. Yes! It can be that easy if you're just spotting the shrimp and you can get to them quick enough. The whiting are so aggressive, they don't hesitate. Even more so than brim. Take a look at this beauty. And it's illegal whiting. I'm not keeping them, I'm just throwing them back. It's great sport fishing this running off the edge, I don't know whether you can see it, it's less than a foot deep in there and the whiting are just pumping all the little shrimp. So I'm just using a little sugar pen that just perfectly represents what they're feeding on and that's why they're coming at it so aggressive. Lots of fun. Whiting on poppers, if you find the right spot, you get the tide right where the tide's just running, I'm near the end of the run here. It's great fun. Just using light six pound line. And there's just teams of these whiting. Often you'll see them in huge packs and that's why they just start to compete over the lure. Get really aggressive and just chase it. Here, there's more after it now, look at this. Yep, there you go again. Oh, it's great fun. Jeez, they go hard for such small fish. And the best part about it is, where there's these whiting, there's going to be some great big flathead, mangrove jack, trevally and dew in the corners and the bends around a little bit further up. Fishing the Gold Coast from a kayak is just sensational, especially creeks like this where you're not getting a boat in here, that's the best part about it. It's so shallow that it just doesn't get the pressure and uh, it's a whole lot of fun really. Here they go again, there's more at it now, I'm just getting hit after hit, there's five, six hits. It's incredible fishing. See the bow waves coming at them, they're like, like mini GTs offshore, the way you can see them just honing in on that lure. And then you've just got to be running super catchy hooks, which on these sugar pens, the hooks are so catchy, that's what it's all about. That's why I'm pinning them, they've only got really soft mouths and they're lipping it. Even though they're flying at them hard, they just, they're just little tiny lips, you've got to have these little pinny hooks, like tournament grade hooks, and that's how you'll get it. 
see the action, I'm bringing it in fairly quick and with the little rod so that I can get a little bit of a kick from the lure to make it shoot like a little skipping prawn or a little shrimp, that's what's going to do the damage. There's one there. Oh, I don't know they're, they're just starting to hoard up these little baby shrimp and there's teams of them chasing. Just got to get right on top of it. It's almost just like worth holding on to the lure and then making the cast once you see it. stuff just on these flats these whiting they go so hard you see the bow wave coming they're just looking for it all the time the moment they're on and they're feeding just fantastic fishing I'm not sure if you can see there but there's stingrays all along the edge here that are just feeding and churning up some of the small yabbies and bait and shrimp and that sort of stuff and these whiting are getting onto us. It's just that light breath of wind on the surface which is enough to just help dull your approach and keep that spell. But that's what we're after. It's such exciting fishing. I mean, they're only small fish, but they go really hard, they're aggressive. And in these natural systems, it's a lot of fun. Off you go, buddy. 